The atmosphere is building. This one is always a classic, but what drama will we have for you today? Don't go anywhere. All the action coming up next. We're in North London for this one. It's the Emirates Stadium. My name's Guy Mowbray. Delighted to be joined by Sue Smith for commentary. And it's all about the Premier League here. It's Arsenal and they take on Liverpool. Cheers, Guy. Well, it's a pleasure to be here. And I'm anticipating a good game today. The coaching staff have done all they can. Now it's about taking it onto the pitch. And into the box it goes. Oh, it's been missed. It looked a good opportunity, that. This is how Arsenal line up. Ben White plays with Alexander Zinchenko as fullbacks. Bakayo Saka starts with Gabriel Martinelli out wide. And the main man leading the attack is Gabriel Jesus. Oh, hang on, what a chance! And ready for it coming his way. Curtis Jones. Good ball. Decent looking attack this. And away from danger it goes. Jesus. Arsenal trying to get things moving. Off the defender, corner kick. A short corner taken. Odegaard. Moving forward well. Saka. Martinelli. Erdegaard. We'll have a go here. Oh, great block. Andy Topham, that's Andy Topham. Can you please return to your vehicle immediately? Thank you. And that's crossed the line. It'll be a throw in. Gabriel Martinelli. Zinchenko. Smith Rowe. Looking for the angle. They've lost it there, and the attack is over. Martinelli. Now there could be a chance to counter. Is there something at the end? Jones. Over them all to the back post. And it's gone in for an own goal. They've given a helping hand. Here we can watch it again, and it's really unlucky. We'll definitely go down as an own goal. There's not much the keeper can do here. And the game restarts with the score 1-0. Gabriel. Rice on to Smith Rowe Martin Erdegaard played to White Declan Rice a free kick awarded here the refs viewed that as a foul Well, certainly wasn't a clean tackle. Might go in the book here. And it is going to be a caution. Yeah, it's a good decision from the ref. I think he knew that it was coming. Uh... 
Approaching half time now, and the hosts look like being behind at the break. Is that a fair reflection? Well, there's not much in it for me, Guy. I think the manager will be happy to get them in at half time, only down one, and just readjust a few things, maybe make some tweaks tactically, and then in the second. Hang on, they could be in. Pulls it back. I don't know how he didn't score. Great defending. Diaz. They found a way through. And they've scored again. That puts them further in front. What a position to be in. Well, if we look at this again, what a ball this is. The weight of pass is just right to set up the opportunity. And all the forward has to do is get on the end of it, which he does so well. It's a really nice finish. Number 17, Curtis Jones. McAllister. On to Gakpo. Good ball in behind. This has to be. And further clear they go. There's surely no throwing this one away. Well, if we look at this again, he shows great vision and awareness to play the ball through. And then through on goal, he decides to go for power. Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. And you have to say it was a good finish. Well, that's going to be all for the first half here at Arsenal. Well, he's played a starring role up to this point. He's been wonderful to watch. He's been the standout, the difference between the two teams. And at times, he's been unplayable. The goals were clinical, and he just looked hungry for more. Arsenal up against it as the second half begins. Can they mount a response in the next 45 minutes? Still going here. Diogo Jota. Still trying to find the space. Alexander Arnold. Gakpo. The chance now for a quick transition. Liverpool have possession again. Good pressure this, high up the pitch. McAllister. Gakpo. Here's the shot. And they've scored again. It's become a question of just how many they'll get. Well, we can have another look at this. It's a brilliant strike. He makes great contact with the ball, and the goalkeeper just watches it fly past him. So it's now 4-0 as the ball gets rolling again. Odegaard. On to Bukayo Saka. Good job done to keep it there. Alexis McAllister. Curtis Jones. Jones. It might still happen. And it's a goal, or is it? That must have been close. Oh, it's really close. He's only just offside, Guy. He needs to keep getting himself into those goal-scoring positions, though. Now Saliba. Smith Rowe. Played to Martinelli.
and able to come away with the ball. Rice. Chops inside now. And the shot thwarted. Saka. Good work to recover possession. And it's on now. And a goal, but slightly all too little to affect the result. But there is still fight left in them. Well, let's look at this again. He's done really well to pick out a teammate here. It's a perfect cutback. And I couldn't see him missing from there. He made a strong connection. Goal it's a nice Arsenal. goal, that. Number eight, Martin Odegaard. Diogo Jota. Arsenal regaining possession. Havertz. Havertz. Saka. Rice. Crucial defending. Could be a chance to break here. That's a nice forward thinking pass. Diaz. Can he finish? Superb defending to stop an almost certain goal. Diogo Jota could do something here and that's nicely won to see off the threat Jesus played to Martinelli Alexis McAllister. Well, that brings a close to the match. A frustrating day here for Arsenal, far from at their best, and it's three points dropped. Yeah, and it was the nature of the performance more than anything. They just never got out of second gear. They were dominated all over the park. I tell you what, I wouldn't want to be in that dressing room after that. Well, there are good games, and then there are games like that. He surely has been the player who's most caught the eye today. Well, he was a constant threat, either playing on the shoulder or looking to drop into space. His movement was so clever, got himself into great goal-scoring positions. Bag two, could have had more.